the once beautiful beaches of Ghana are sliding into the ocean. The West African nation boasts a coastline of nearly 350 miles, but increasingly, that coast is being claimed by the sea. According to a UNESCO study, from 2005 to 2017, 37% of Ghana's eastern coastal land was lost due to erosion and flooding, and that share is likely to grow. The country, like so many others across the globe, faces rising sea levels due to human-caused climate change. The University of Cape Coast says Ghana's shoreline is moving at a rate of about two meters a year. That's bad news for the nearly eight million people, a quarter of Ghana's population, who live by the sea. The coastal erosion is affecting their lives in countless ways. More than 4,000 families have had to relocate, after being displaced by the encroaching seas, houses and businesses are slowly being consumed. Benjamin Kami runs a recreation business in the capital, Accra region. Or at least he did, before losing the land to the rising waters. He says the erosion is putting people's lives at risk. Government agencies in Ghana are attempting to address the situation, but if climate change is not arrested by larger, multinational efforts, there may be only so much Ghana can do to protect the precious coast. This is Inside Edition Digital.